Good evening and thank you for joining us. It's a vote that could impact how your tax dollars are spent. And tonight, some Tucson teachers are accusing one group of deliberately trying to confuse voters. News 4 Tucson's Nick Vinzant tells us it all has to do with campaign signs and a controversial proposition. It's new at 10. This is a red for ed sign. This is a sign urging voters to vote yes on Proposition 305, something officials with the Red for Ed movement say they are absolutely against. It's pretty disappointing, and, and at some points I might even say it's despicable. Jason Freed with the Tucson Education Association says the yes on 305 signs copies the Red for Ed movement's signature color, font, and style, changing only the hashtag from Red for Ed to Yes for Ed. There's an attempt to steal, and, and it really is, it's stealing from educators, from the educators who've given time, energy, um, passion, sweat to try to help our kids, help our community, help Arizonans. In response to written questions, a spokesperson for Yes for Ed says, quote, the signs and messaging are clear. They simply encourage people to vote yes on Prop 305. The Yes for Ed makes clear Prop 305 is pro-education. As written, Proposition 305 would let all students qualify for an empowerment scholarship account. Supporters say it's a way to give students and parents options. Opponents say it's a way to use public money for private schools. There's nothing wrong with private schools. They just don't deserve to be funded with public dollars. Now the last day to register to vote is October 9th. The election is on November 6th. For News 4 Tucson, I'm Nick Vinzan. New developments today in the case.